into the Grade 1 Haskell Stakes next. Uh, this is over nine furlongs on the dirt for three year olds, and the top one is Hefi Hink for Vinnie Gerard. Django's Jewel for Django. McCracken for John Morgan. Notre Dame firing for Molly at Surfer. Outside area for Darren Thompson. Race from the Storm. Joshua Sutherland, Rome Quest, Paul Rhodes, Send It for Django, Storm in Norman for Paul Rhodes, Telekinesis for John Morgan, Chizu Creator for Vinnie Gerard and Main Just Bookie for Dan Hughes. So 12 of them then. In the stalls and out they come. And the closest to us is the grey for John Morgan. I'm not sure which one that is, whether it's McCracken or Telekinesis. Okay. Probably is Telekinesis and he's now making a forward move to go towards the lead. But Django's Jewel is going to be the one that leads him through the first furlong or so. Then Django's Jewel is the clear leader there by a good three lengths. And this one looks to be the only one that wants to go on. The Rome Conquest is now coming to the pack to take second. Then Chizu Creator and Stormy Norman. If I hink and send it. Telekinesis is wide on the track. Notre Dame Fire is just a back marker. But it's Django's Jewel in the lead then by a good three lengths to Stable Companion Send It, who's just poked his head in a second, ahead of Storm in Norman, Chizu Creator and Roman Conquest. Then comes Hefi Hink, and the two greys together, McCracken and Telekinesis, both John Morgan, both grey. Then comes Notre Dame Foreign, race from the Storm is towards the back. Main just Bucky is going widest of all, and outside area is the back marker. But Django's Jewel then races down towards the four furlong pole with the lead, but he's now collared by Storming Norman and Storming Norman has stormed into the lead. Storming Norman in by a neck to Django's jaw as they race away. Then comes Hefi Hink and McCracken, then send it. They're getting quite well spread out now. In well inside the final three furlongs, Django's Jewel's got back into the lead. Stormy Norman is second. Hefi Hink gonna need a split on the inside. Then comes McCracken, send it after that. I think we can probably forget the rest. Then come into the final two furlongs. It's Django's Jewel from Stormy Norman. Hefi Hink needs a bit of luck. On the outside is McCracken. It's Django's Jewel and Stormy Norman. They're keeping Hefi Hink in. They're into the final furlong. Django's Jewel, Stormy Norman tries to challenge on the outside. Still Django's Jewel and Stango. Django's Jewel just starts to pull away and racing up towards my Django. But now Hefi Hink gets the split and here comes McCracken and McCracken sweeps to take it. McCracken takes it. Hefi Hink was second. Django's Jewel was third in the end. Came off the fence a little bit and let them through. And McCracken is the winner. McCracken takes it for John Morgan. Hefi Hink for Vinnie Gerard second. Django's Jewel for Django was third. Send it for Django was fourth. And Stormy Norman for Paul Rhodes was fifth.